to brush your teeth? Are you a sad girl? Are you a sad? Oh, you look so sad to get your toothbrush. Hey guys, it's your girl Gabs, and I'm clearly here today with my homegirl Sham. Today, I guess, is a vlog, kinda. I don't really know what I'm doing with this channel anymore. <laughs> it's kinda just me living life in, that's my dog. Um, today, we're going to get Shamrock a toothbrush because this dog has the nastiest breath I've ever experienced. And we talked to her vet, and they're like, oh, you can like give her a carrot, and the carrot like helps their breath smell good. And, and um, actually, they lied, okay? It doesn't at all. Her breath smells awful. No offense. I love you, but you smell a little gross. So this is our adventure getting a toothbrush and then we're gonna watch me brush her teeth and see how that goes so hope you guys enjoy and if you do be sure to like and if you like me and my dog even though he just disappeared out of the frame be sure to subscribe and here we go Cause I got issues, So, me and Shamrock are back from our little adventure at PetSmart, and we picked up her toothbrush and toothpaste. I picked Nylabone, this Nylabone one. It was like 17 bucks, I'm pretty sure. And I got it because she has bones from them, and I'm like, maybe she'll like them. Like, this too, that's where my thought process was. Because Shamrock is very picky about things. Like, it sounds odd, but she's like human, kind of. Like, she'll only have certain things, and like, she has particular tastes in different things. And sometimes stuff doesn't react well with her. So this is why I picked this brand, because I know she's familiar with, like, their bones. So I'm hoping we have success with this. Um, this one is for adults, because technically she's an adult dog, even though she looks really small. Um, what it says is you first let your dog taste the toothpaste, and then you use your finger and rub it on their teeth in a circular motion. And then you introduce the toothbrush with a small amount of toothpaste, and then you allow your dog to taste, then gently start brushing back and forth motion, and no rinsing necessary. This is an easy thing. Hopefully this goes good with her, because I'll be embarrassed if it doesn't, but she's a little fickle right now. She's being a little moody. I think she wanted to go on a longer journey, but, you know, it's okay. So we're just going to see what happens with this. So let's get started. Okay, here we go. I open the pack. You want to sniff? Oh, I forgot to also mention, after you brush your teeth, you always have to praise them and treat them for it. It's not like, so it's not traumatizing for them. Sorry, this lighting is awful. So we're opening up this bad boy. Not very well, but we're opening it. Yeah, you sniff it. Okay. You have no interest in this, do you? Ooh, look at it. There's a little bit, so I have a little bit on my finger. She's right. We're a fan! Can I see your teeth? Okay, I'm gonna do this gently. Shamrock lets me do this, but your dog may be a little meaner about it. Oh, look at that. Oh, this one also, I forgot to mention, comes with a finger brush. Because I think Shamrock's gonna like this better, because it's at least a human finger. I don't know about the toothbrush. You might not be a fan. Come on, baby. Ready? Want to try it? She's not interested in Okay, we're going to try to put a little bit on here and go for it. She just has stinky breath. I'm just admitting it now. She'll lick the toothpaste, no problem. Okay, let's try to do this. Here we go. Here we go. We're brushing your teeth, dog. We're brushing your teeth. Ooh, she does not like that. She don't like that at all. That got scary real quick. I'm going to try to do it on my finger because I think I'll have a little bit more success because it's my finger, not an actual brush. You got to be, it's okay. Okay, gentle. See? See? Oh, I'm sorry, I'm like hurting your nose. Sorry. Let me get those little teeth first. Let me come here. There you go. Look at it. So fun. I mean, it's good that she likes the toothpaste, honestly. Is there any back teeth that I'm missing? Yeah, yeah. This is a fun adventure. She just keeps licking it, and I think it's just annoying her because I have to grab, like, in her mouth. She keeps licking. <laughs> I feel like a dog dentist. Get a brush and floss every day, honey. Just kidding. <laughs> See puns. I hate myself sometimes. Jesus. Girl, you can't eat all the toothpaste. I'm trying to brush your teeth. Come here. Okay, look at me. You have toothpaste on your mouth. Her teeth look better. I'm being honest. Let me do them gums. Because, you know, they say that's good for humans. I don't know about dogs, though. <laughs> I don't know much about this. Her teeth are getting cleaner, if I'm being really honest. We don't really do anything for her teeth. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. So I'm trying to get the bottoms. It might look like I'm torturing her. I'm really not. 
You're such a good girl. Thank you so much for letting me do that. Thank you. Well, that there was our adventure. Shamrock, like I said, is different. She likes doesn't like the toothbrush, but she liked the finger brush, so that is something to keep in mind. I think it's more familiar to her because I just stick my fingers in there sometimes to get her used to that when the doctors do it to check on her teeth. So that's interesting. That's nice that they come with both. So if your dog doesn't like the one, you can try the other. So I'm going to go get her a treat. Um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, like I said before, be sure to like it if you like me and my dog. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know when that's going to be, but anyway, bye, friends. <laughs> Shamrock. Oh, I just whacked really hard in the neck. I'm sorry.